What's going on gamers? It's Raz and Grind. I'm here with another video and today I wanted to talk about Microsoft and Microsoft considered um, a discless console uh, according to this article that I'm reading and I will link it to the end of the description below. But according to Phil Spencer, and this is a quote from him, obviously after the announcement in E3 there was some feedback about the people wanting to change. There was a real discussion about whether we should have an optical disk drive in Xbox One or if we should get get away with a purely diskless console. But when you start looking at bandwidth and game size, it does create issues, end quote. Now, uh, for Phil Spencer, and my question is, you know, if that's the only thing that brings up problems for the Xbox One, then you are sadly mistaken. And I hope you wasn't on. You guys seem to be uh, so uninformed and untu in touch with your uh, fan base that you put out comments like that. I believe if they would have went through with this, I wouldn't have bought an Xbox One at all. As a matter of fact, I wouldn't even supported them, and I definitely would have went with a PS4. Um, but luckily for them, they kind of got it together and they thought that it, was, it wouldn't have been a good idea. I believe that the Xbox One without the disk drive would look exactly like the Steam Box. If you guys seen pictures of the Steam Box, it would have looked exactly like it. They look too similar to me in my opinion. But anyway, so with that being said, this brings up a couple of other questions. And uh, I actually, an uh, issue I was thinking, um, what do you think about... Uh, disc and uh non-disc games like do you want to go di all digital or do you want to play disc me personally i believe you should do some of both because uh this this games gives you some type of um re uh, i'm gonna say uh it gives you something back for what you bought so you can resell your game or trade it in or whatever the case may be and still get something back for it rather if you go digital if you play a game and you don't like it or if you're just done with the game completely within a month you're stuck with that game and so you got to kind of think what replay value do you have for any game that you like that you want to play so that's all i got for you guys i'm gonna wrap this video up as i always say bang bang i'm lying i never say that that's next gen 720 thanks for watching like the video uh subscribe if you want to see more of me Thanks for watching. I'm Raz. I'm out.